So this is Dave with OC Astronomy. I'm here back um, with the Celestron CGX scope. And uh, I'm happy to report that the modification with adjusting the backlash or the, the right ascension uh, gear meshing appears to have done the trick. It is a really hot night tonight. I, I'm not gonna really put faith in this image, but um, this is the, uh, let's see if I can get some stuff out of the way for you. This is the images that I'm get, getting, it looks like. Let's see. Yeah, got some good round stars. It's obviously hot. Um, there's a lot of noise in this image. But here's the other factor, is the guiding. Here's the Maxim graph of the guiding, and it seems pretty calm. It's, it's actually a little bit windy today, so it's not perfect conditions, but here's my X and Y typicals. They're, you know, within a pixel and a half or, you know, a third. Every now and then I get a little bit of an excursion up to two, but it's, it's nothing very bad and it recovers right away. Um, there's nothing like I saw with the big jumps to like 12 or 15 and the stars are not coming out as uh, ellipses. So let's see if I can, I'll have to just zoom that in a little bit. Anyway, I think that that's pretty good. Another image just came off and it's looking pretty nice. Another thing I'll make a comment about is I have the the Edge HD 1100 scope and you can see that even way out here in the corner um, or down here these stars are very nice. I'm gonna just get the camera a little bit closer to the screen so you can see. I mean these stars are pretty good. That one was a little bit jumpy. I think that that was me actually since I'm farting around and making this video, I think it was me that made that that jump. I won't blame I won't blame the scope this time. Um, but the uh, it looks like making that adjustment has made it behave itself better. Yeah, I see that that one Y error there minus three point seven two. I'm pretty sure that was me wiggling around. Normally whenever I take images, I like to go downstairs and get out of the dome. I was only in the dome so I could make adjustments, but I'm trying to be very still and it seems to be okay. Um, I'm only taking 30 second subs of this, uh, it's M52 that I'm, that I'm trying to get right now. So anyway, that should be some encouragement. Um, the scope may be a little finicky, but it should also be adjustable if you know where to look. And uh, I'm certainly grateful to Cloudy Nights Forum, because without Cloudy Nights, I would have been completely in the dark. I <laughs> uh, take my jokes when I can get them, people. All right, well, good luck to you if you have the same uh, problem. And it looks like adjusting the the RA to deck meshing so that you have a little bit of, of spring available uh, instead of it being rock solid will help cure that um, stiction problem or jumpy stars problem whatever you want to call it um, so good luck to you